Hi everybody, I am here with another project and um, I did this after watching Scrap and Happy XO's video tonight. Um, I was so uber excited, but um, that's going to be the video that I'm going to give you the link of. That's going to be on my bucket list to do, but I got the inspiration from looking at her altering an organza bag and she altered it about halfway and so I just took that idea not the concept of how it was made other than using an organza bag and only altering part of it so um again watch that video down below and again mine looks nothing like hers just the basic concept of an organza bag okay so, um, what I did was I turned the bag inside out first and I lined the inside with, um, scraps from the last wedding dress that I cut up and then I turned it right side out, I guess, or the outside. I layered that as well with, um, the wedding, um, fabric scraps. And then this right here, this is a vintage organza um, curtain that is embroidered with um, cotton embroidery. And I put that over the wedding fabric scraps. And then I took this trim that... Um, is part of the October alteration kit in my store and I put that all the way around the bottom and then this right here is a sneak peek at what will be in my store for November and it is this two layered dimensional um, wedding trim and it looks like this and so I put that over the Venice fringe put this over it and then this tool looped wedding trim is also in the October alteration kit and it's got um, gold metallic thread and then I took these appliques that is coming in November and where is it? Oh, here it is. So it's this. It's um three layers. As you can see, it's gorgeous. This will be for November. And I put that here. I, do, I only put three. And then this is the back of the bag. I didn't want to cover all of this up because it is so pretty. And I just used that to cover the, the um, sides here where the, um, you know, where you needed to cover up um, to finish the edges on each side. Okay, and then I used some vintage eyelet ruffle trim and I put that up here and then I put more of the tool um, looped pearl wedding trim and I think it came out so pretty so thank you Jeanette for the inspiration and again, the bag that she made, I so want to try it, but um, I still am on training wheels on the dark side. <laughs> um, so once I get a little more advanced, then I'll try um, the bag that Jeanette made because I, I think it is so beautiful. So thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And also click the button over to the right, the little bell, and that will give you email alerts every time I upload a video. Have a great day.